everyone. This is Cheryl from Cheryl Ferocious Garden. You've purchased your tropical pitcher plant. Now you're questioning, how should I take care of it? I'm gonna give you three easy steps to take care of your tropical pitcher plant. Now this is the Alata. The Alata is the best plant for beginners and it's a fast grower and very easy to take care of. These are your three elements. First of all, you need to keep the plant moist at all times. Number one, do not let it dry out. You wanna keep it moist. Make sure your soil is moist. Get a spritz gun, spritz it. That helps with the humidity. Second of all, you need to keep it out of full direct sun. It needs to be under a canopy of a tree, a patio, a porch, any place where there's not full direct sun. And lastly, it needs to have bugs. It is a coniferous plant, and that's how the plant gets its nutrients from the bugs. So make sure it's in a place where it can readily get bugs. If not, there's one other little trick. You could go to a pet store. You could buy dried crickets or little mealyworms and feed the plant yourself. You would just drop a bug in the mouth of the pitcher, one or two bugs per month, and that's enough to keep the plant nice and healthy. Now from the pitcher, each pitcher gives off a nectar, which comes from the inside. It's like a perfume. Bugs smell it, but we don't. It lures them in they end up in the stomach, which produces enzymes, and in that stomach, it dissolves the bugs and feed the plant through the vein. Thank you for watching, and again, if you have any questions at all, please email me at sdt0289 at aol.com. That's my email address, and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions. Thank you.